Yeah, the problem, uh, Mr. Islam always lose. By the way, Islam is lose. Uh, I don't know if you saw my channel title. You're a prophet, he said, because your name is Islam always win, right? Which is not what your prophet said. Do you see this is in the top of my channel? Muhammad said in Sahih Muslim 146, Islam crawls as a serpent crawls back in its hole. So how you win an Islam is going to crawl like a snake inside the hole. And I find it, by the way, funny because this is what you Hamas are doing. You crawl inside your hole. By the way, Islam is winning, but the Israeli took almost all of Gaza back. But Islam is winning. Uh, cease fire! Cease fire! Uh, so if Islam is winning, why you want to cease fire? Don't you want to win more? You ask for a cease fire because you are a loser. Not because you are a winner. And by the way, did you see the tunnel under the hospital? Here we go. Do you remember when they said a long time ago there's a tunnel under the hospitals and Muslim they say it's a lie and they have interview at Jazeera, they have interview with doctors in the hospital, they say this is absolutely false. They are just trying to hit the medical centers, blah, 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 blah. Here we go. The tunnel is there. And today they took many journalists to visit the tunnel. Uh, you know what? Soon we will open a casino there. It's called Hamas Casino, Tunnel Casino. This is the hole. And by the way, Hamas are there in the hole. And this is the tunnel which is connected to the hospital. If you look in the corner of the screen, I don't know if you can see it, let me... They are showing you how the tunnel look like as a design. There's a graphic. Do you see the graphic? So now they are going inside the tunnel where the rats live. If I stop here, actually, Sadly, when I click at the video to stop it, it make oh, hold on. Let me try to zoom in. Here, the graphic in the corner. But when I click at the video, maybe if I uh, if I go back, let us see this, and I play, then you can see it better. Do you see how the graphic working? So they are showing you now how they are going down, deep, deep, deep down. All right, the graphic is showing you. And then the tunnel goes to the right side. I will play the video again, but just to show you the graphic. The tunnel keep going all the way until it goes under exactly the hospital. I will play the video again, don't worry. I mean, just we are focusing in the graphic here now. So you can see how the details. So if I move it a little bit here, like here he is moving, you know, it says 50 meters. So let us go and see the video from the beginning. This is how coward they are. It turned to be that the Israeli, they are saying the truth. And the Mohammedan, as usual, they never say something truthful. And they are using the hospital as a human shield. Because they knew the Israeli cannot bomb a hospital. If they do, the whole international community will condemn them. 
And this is why actually they force even civilians to stay in the hospital to be sure that even the yards of the hospital will be forbidden zone. So the Israeli cannot accomplish anything against them. And now they go down. You will notice they have a ladder. The ladder is made from metal. And it's very deep. I don't know if you can see the stairs. It's covered by dust due to the digging or maybe explosions. And this is the center of the stairs. It's like around the store. It's, it's like, you know, it's like a, uh, around, around the column going in circle. You keep going down all the way to the bottom of the tunnel. And now we are in the tunnel. And by the way, they are not done yet. They reach all the way to a door. But they did not open that door because they are afraid that there is a trap, like a bomb if you open it. So they have to find a way to, to get in without going through that door because they don't want to open the door. I mean, they can explode the whole thing, but they want to they wanna use the tunnel uh, as approved, they don't want to destroy it. Same time, they want to see what is behind the door. It might be something important. See, this is a door which is, here you see, firing hole, which means there's a hole you can shoot from it in case of you want to shoot at somebody. So at the end of the tunnel, there is a door. Let us go back. And that door is bullet and explosion proof, very thick. In the door, there's a hole to fire at anyone who want to get close to. So you never know, maybe there is Hamas inside. I hope so. Maybe even there's hostages inside. This is from, you know, yesterday. We do not know. Actually, you know, uh, the CNN, he went during night, which is a few hours ago. So I think still the door is still closed. Those rats, they claim to be men, they claim to be fighters, they claim to be brave, but the fact they are a bunch of cowards when real army come to them, they are hiding, there is nowhere to, no, they, you cannot even fight them. And they are using civilians to protect themselves. And you know, for me, when I use the word civilian, I mean, civilian supposedly is someone is not carrying a gun. But I believe that every, everybody is involved in this war, and the civilians are the first one to be involved. Like, you know, Hamas member, they have mothers. Well, the mothers are civilians. Okay. Are they supporting their sons in their war? Absolutely. What about their wives and children? They support their daddy? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, they are civilians. By international law, I'm not going to talk about a child now. I'm going to talk about adult. If you do hide a terrorist, if you support a terrorist, if you feed shelter a terrorist, you are a terrorist. Is that correct? Is that correct? It is. 